I'm in a good mood. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, we are so back. Gift of Stellarium. Ten free temples. Ten free temples all at once. Wait. No, not ten free temples. Ten free pulls. All at once. Free. Penacony. Looks incredible. Black Swan. Fish. Event. Event. Interesting. I didn't really I don't really know what the events are about. Let's test the new characters. That's what we're gonna do. That's what this video is all about. Companion quests. I'm assuming for Sparkle and for Black Swan, we got companions quests. Awesome. Oh my god, man. Black Swan looks incredible. Black Swan looks incredible. We also got pure fiction to go through. That is going to be very, very fun. All right. Who should we do first? Uh, we don't exactly have game sound on. Let's do Misha first. Whoops. Okay. Wait, is there no way to turn the volume on? What are we saying, bro? All right. By the way, warps. Incredible. This character is so cool, by the way. Dunhung Ael is awesome. Really cool character. What does her light cone do? Where's effect hit rate by 40% when the wearer deals damage to an enemy inflicted with burn? Okay, no, it's uh, it's more dot stuff. Okay. That is, that is a, you know, that's pretty obvious. Pretty evident it's supposed to be that way. Let's just do one random pull on Don Hung IL. If we get him, it's meant to be. If we get him, it's meant to be. But we didn't. I was just making sure it wasn't meant to be. We gotta do that. Okay, let's go. I'm excited to unlock this. Alright, this is not what we're doing. This is not what we're supposed to be doing here. <clears throat> Let's get to it. Let's get to it. Let's look at these characters. So, Misha. Looks pretty cool. When an ally consumes skill points, this character regenerates energy and increases their ultimates. It's per action. Okay. Uh, this character's ultimate can freeze enemies. Okay. Pretty cool looking character. I haven't seen... I haven't been paying attention to any leaks or anything. Is that a hammer? Is that a mop? That's a mop. Okay, that makes sense. Bus boy. And then... Oh, that's the really cool freeze thing. Character looks cool. Okay. Let's fight. That's pretty crazy. Now we give him some back shots. I not my character. Uh, room service skill deals ice damage to an enemy and minor ice damage to enemies adjacent to them. In addition, increased Misha's sorry, increase Misha's next ultimate hit per action. What does that even mean, bro? Ultimate hits per action. Okay, let's let's read the talent. When an ally consumes one skill point, Misha's next ultimate delivers more hits per action and Misha regenerates energy. Okay. Technique. Creates a dimension that stops all units within. Upon entering battle against enemies within the dimension, Misha's next ultimate deals more hits per action. Okay, does his ultimate like hit for multiple numbers? Interesting. Okay, wait, yeah, we should read his ultimate, obviously. It was minor ice damage to a, to single enemies. Okay, so it deals minor ice damage to a single enemy. Uh, the attack bounces among enemies three times by default and up to a maximum of ten times before each hit lands. 
there's a minor chance to freeze the target. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool. So it can go up to 10 times. It's kind of like, uh, what's her name? Um, I use heal. You choose the first person it hits. Everything else is afterwards. Jesus, this character is un unbelievable. I love that character. All right, we're gonna blast them. Oh my god, we just mopped the floor with them. Enemy data secure. Net markers activated. Time for good old counter attack. This looks so slow, by the way. What are we saying? Oh my god, Hanya's beautiful. Like the Ten Lords decree. Holy hell, man. She's the most beautiful character in the game. I don't care. I don't care, bro. I, I'm right. I'm right. Can I get my ult? All right, here we go. Oh my god, that's funny. Alright. Let's speed this thing up now. We've seen everything. I shall be the judge. Enemy targets detected. Oh. Enemy data six net marker festival. Time for a good old counter attack. Ole. You know, in my in my character tier list, people say that I, you know, I undervalue Anya. And all I'm saying is I value her very, very uh, a lot, very a lot. Yes. She shines. She definitely shines on a specific tier list. Oh yeah. That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. Take our dubs. What the hell is this? What? I'm being trolled. Level up traces moderately for harmony characters. Do we not see? Did we did we forget? All right, devs. Guys, before you guys say anything in the comments, I'm playing dumb. I just think it's insanely stupid. But that is a thing that they're doing. Whatever, though. So. Okay. We already know what this guy does. I mean, let's go. And this guy is so awesome. Like, this is so broken for some universe. I forgot about that. Oh my god. What a badass character. We already know what this guy does, alright? If you don't know... Got to figure it out. But he is a such a cool character. Oh yeah. Ole. Man. Like why they actually have to make him such a Bad ass character, bro. A thousand wonders to raise you
Man, Don Hung Il is such a cool character. It's like if I didn't have a free doctor ratio, I would get him. But I just feel like I don't know. It's almost upsetting in a way. Where I really, really, really want him. Because I find him to be so badass. And I know I'm going for Sparkle. So if I have him, QQ, and Sparkle, that'll be crazy. Um, Man. It's just like, what would I... So let's assume I fully build him, right? Then why would I ever use Dr. Ratio? You know what I'm saying? If I fully build Dr. Ratio, why would I ever use Don Hung IL? You know? You know what I'm saying? Maybe I'll get him on his next, next rerun. But. Hard to say. It's really hard to say. Multiple ways to apply special DOT. Black Swan can trigger a special effects based on the number of stacks. Use this character's ultimate to quickly gain more dot stacks. And this character is so beautiful. I'm really, ha I'm really happy that she is in the game, just because I think she is so fucking cool. But, oh my god, it's so badass. She's so cool. Make a wish. Um, wow. It's just that I don't have Kafka, right? I don't use dot teams. I would have to upgrade Kafka, her. Honestly, that's really it. But I just missed out on Kafka. I, I chose not to go for Kafka. I can't really go back now. Right? Black Swan is awesome. But, yeah. Okay. Uh, Silent Dawn. Basic attack. Now, this one is actually the first, what I believe, I think it's the first. Some, there's some characters where talents buff their basic attack, make their basic attack do more things if it's buffed by their talent, uh, by their skill, sorry. Um, but this is the first one where the basic attack itself has an additional effect. I'm 99.9% .9 sure. And that's really cool, because I've been asking for that for a while. If there's an Iridition character where the basic attack is an AoE attack, that would be cool. That would be cool. Uh, deals minor wind damage to a single enemy and has applying. Wait, it has a chance of applying Arcana to the target. After attacking the target that suffers, uh, after attacking a target that suffers wind shear, bleed, burn, or shock, there is there is respectively a chance of additionally applying Arcana. Okay. So, skill. Deals minor wind damage to a single enemy target and adjacent targets with a high chance of inflicting arcana on targets and lowering their defense. Ultimate. Inflicts epiphany on all enemies, increasing the damage as th the damage the targets take in their turn. Additionally, having arcana is regarded as having wind shear, bleed, burn, and shock. Furthermore, arcana will not reset as it stacks after causing damage at the start of a turn. Deals wind damage to all enemies. That's really cool. That's really cool. Loom of Fate's Capris. Capris. Caprice. Uh, when an enemy target receives Dot at the start of a turn, there's a chance for it to be inflicted with Arcana. If it received Wind Dot at the start of the turn, Black Swan triggers an additional... Black Swan triggers additional effects based on the number of Arcana stacks. Okay. Technique. After this technique is used, at the start of the next battle, there is a high chance after... For each enemy to inflict, be inflicted with Arcana repeatedly until Arcana fails to be inflicted. So that's pretty nuts. Right? This character is so badass. Right? It's all about having dots, applying dots, and she has her own unique dot that no other character can put in the game. And it's based off of the other dots that they have on them. That's crazy. Everyone's a customer. They have five Arcana on them right now. Let's just see what that does. Takes one damage at the start of each turn. Being afflicted with Arcana will also be considered as suffering from Wind Shear. This state stacks up to 50 times. All 
All right, let's burn him. Let's blast him. That's crazy that Arcana deals damage to things around it. Wait, is it? Is that not crazy? Alright, let's see the salt. Oh, we weren't doing it on, uh, we weren't doing on partial speed. Sorry. We'll get back to that. We'll do that. Oh my god. Oh my man, she's so hot. Are we look are we seeing this? Alexa, change the light to purple. Are we seeing this? Guys. What? Oh my god! Characters that throw cards are cool in whatever game they are in. It really doesn't matter. If they throw cards, they're badass. That's how it works. Twisted Fate? Badass! This character is so badass. This character really is so good. If I went Kafka, I would be the happiest little shit. I would be the... I'd have the biggest... Baddest, most shit eatingest grin on my face. Thinking about how, well, pulling this character right now, I'd be pulling the shit for her. Pulling the shit out of her for her. But I don't even want to test fate. I don't even want to test fate and see if the game gives it to me in one pull, like it did for Don Hung IL. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. All right. Uh, at the end of this video, if you made it to the end, I really appreciate that. And you guys are going to get to watch me pull. Five stellar warps. That's right. Five whole stellar warps. Yeah. I know. That's pretty insane. I'm not going to lollygag with lame ones. Okay. Can we, come on. Like, can we at least get a purple? No? I think about how getting a purple would be. Wouldn't that be so cool? What about a five star? What about a, wouldn't that be cool too? Okay, clearly that's that's not cool. All right, thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. Oh, I oh shit! I accidentally oh man, I accidentally clicked on that. That was crazy. Oof, good thing I didn't get him. <laughs> that would suck. Uh, anyway, uh, yeah, thank you all for watching. Uh, have an amazing rest of your life subscribe to the channel like the video comment you know what to do how do you feel about black swan are you pulling her peace